would probably have at some point engaged in something to certain levels, to different levels, immoral, whether it's speech, whether it's perhaps the dress code, sometimes it could become something of a sexual nature that is immoral. It's also known as immorality. Now, what hope do I have? A person who's committed adultery, fornication, not dressed properly, uh, bad vulgar words, really terrible accusations, so many different things. What do I do? What do I do? What type of hope? I need healing and I need hope. The first thing you have from Allah is hope. If you look at verse number 135 of Surah Ala Imran, Allah says, وَالَّذِينَ إِذَا فَعَلُوا فَاحِشَةً أَوْ ظَلَمُوا أَنفُسَهُمْ ذَكَرُوا اللَّهِ فَاسْتَغْفَرُوا لِذُنُوبِهِمْ Those who commit any form of immorality on any level of immorality, including adultery, fornication, whatever else it may be. Allah says, those who have wronged themselves in any way, committed any sin, if they remember Allah and seek forgiveness, Allah says, and if they don't continue in their bad ways, so you need these three things. Remember Allah, seek forgiveness and don't continue in your bad ways. Allah says, we forgive them. We wipe out the sin, no matter what it was, completely, totally gone. And Allah says, these people, their reward and their recompense is forgiveness from their Lord and paradise, beneath which runs rivers flowing of all sorts of things. SubhanAllah. Allah says that those are the people. Who are they? The ones who committed the sins, but they didn't stay uh, focused on them.